Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Blasphemy. When we last left off, we met a lady who had been stabbed with six swords and got a health increase. This game is weird. I think there's a lot, I think a lot of things we can get, to be honest. But yeah, we're currently inside this monastery, which is weird, and it's, well, everything looks like it's playing weird. He's pulling a chain, dropped on lava. Can't quite get him. Oh, thank God I don't. You can't take me, Penitent One. My penance is to pull the chain for you. Yeah, you gotta take those guys out, otherwise, I'll just keep pulling the chains on you. And that's not fun. That no bueno. No fun, all, baby. But yeah, we got more health. And if I did the further thing, was it? Hit somebody. No. That did not hurt him. He went straight through that lava. That's molten metal. How'd you get across here? I can jump on. Blood tiles, dude. Hey, we got a new thing to read. This one's the sternum of Vitus, the performer. Custodian remembers with animation the name of Vitus Vanus. He aspired, he inspired the lives of his people through his altruistic actions as well as his inspirational words. He's all stopped, so that means that I got the guy who's tipping them out. Ow. Ow! I died because of the touch box. Boo! Well, at least the impact there is not to be too hard because I have to climb the mountain. Yeah, so I'm going to go side of that. I don't actually. Ooh, no. Nope, still take damage for that. Ah, now help me get through that one. Go. You know this only lasts for so long, and you really don't have much health. I like me. One, two, three, stop. Missed entirely. Let's see. One, two, three, stop. Die. Ah, last time, I, that's right, last time I jumped him, kicked him to the floor. It was cheaty, but it won. The easiest way to do this section is to get rid of the guy on the other side of the wall thing. I don't know. It takes a while to build the further you need to kill these guys to leash your own specials. And I'm gonna jump a little higher and then go this. Ow. She bopped me in the head. <laughs> he got hit in the head by a giant mace. You'd think my pointy hat would have stopped it. Pink. Ha ha. What is this blasphemy? Actually, yes, it's the name of the game. Yeah, 
Yeah, killing those guys with the um big fire big penis attack of mine is better. Ha ah, set for the last second, mate. That was more the case to get rid of the annoyance. I don't think it counts it because I'm hanging onto the wall and I'm jumping up in the animation. Whoa. But I kind of want to trigger him off to jump it, make him jump. I'm not fine to lay down there or call him a lava jump, molten metal jumping on me all the time. If I had reach, I could take you out from there. I thought after you know, I just suddenly realized I should back off. Just a little. Just in case that way when she dies kills sets off like a death bomb or something. They actually hit really hard, but they've got a very slow attack animation. Reach is good though. You up? No. <laughs> Ow. You're on the other side of the wall, aren't you? Whoop. Come on, jump through. Personally, I think I should actually kill them too. Okay, I need to jump across and across and across. Okay, so looking at the map, this is an upper chamber back into the room I just left. I could probably avoid all this by simply walking through that upper chamber door. Yep. Okay, and you got a thing, a room full of poison. Oh, I get both of them? Oh, well, there's one guy there. Hmm. That might have been just a one. Oh, wow. I'd prefer to do that if I had full vial all my health. Which I think I go down across, I can open a shortcut back up to here again. Yeah. I want to explore a little lower. What's that? What the Jesus hell is that thing? No, I'm out here. Pull. No. And the penguin one went no. And the enemy went yes, fight me. And the penguin one went no, bugger it. What? Boom holy that idea, oh. Okay, because quite frankly, I don't like the idea of that thing. That thing just went boop. The long range. It's like a wax entity, it just like appears and zaps. 
That's what you call a powerful enemy. It's like the kid blows it off. It's like, you know what? Kid blows it off now. Forget about the jumping frog guys. Forget about the mountain ladies. I'm going to show you the real butt whoppers of this convent. Dealt with that one. Oh, I got a myth. Oh, waste of fever. Let's get rid of those guys. Ha, I can't get through the wall. they come down here to get me. Nope. Nope. And nope. Stay crouched. Oh. Oh, they're coming on. So essentially, the last thing you want to do is fight that thing in an open area. Right, so the angle is correctly, you can actually hit them from the floor like this. Come on, I was doing four. Gotcha. Yeah. The um, heroically tactical way of doing this. A what? The heroically tactical way of doing this. What does that mean? It means cheat like hell and use a really nasty counter attack. Ow. Oh, that range things range as well. Bang. You know what? No. You didn't die. Nope. 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 Ha! You can't get me from there. Okay, I've got something from this guy now. The Flame Flanex of Miram, the Counselor. Miram Barto knew that it took to, what it took to succeed, but fate is unpredictable. For a terrible illness shortened her life, her legacy was eternal to those who loved her. Can you guys like, give me regen or something? Regen? Yes, the ability to regenerate health. Oh no, penance of wonders, the ideas would be painful! I don't care. I want health regeneration because it's fun for me and bad for them. What is that? No. You want me to come down here? You want me, I'm here. Got rid of that one quick. Thankfully, this jump was not far enough. Nope, we can't destroy those, which would be nice, actually. Chomp, 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 chomp. And off, off, off. Can't really 
Okay, I won't jump away from you, dude. Medium red bead of red wax. Okay, so I got bigger bead of red wax now. So we have accumulated crimson wax, echoes the ancient prayers resound in the core, moderately reinforces the vitality of the wearer. I like that. I wanna I need to get some way to actually you know, increase the size of my pen my prayer bead. Ow. It's got medium reinforcement of my life force. <sighs> ah, I know, actually, I know why that's feeling the way, exactly the way it is, because I need the poison room section there. Oh. We have only a small amount of health left. No, I'd rather take on the poison room, to be honest. Oh yeah, I gotta go this way. What made this section hard was the wax ladies who jumped around zapping people and throwing deadly light, deadly blasts at people. And that made the place hard. The other enemies are not hard. It's the wax ladies, those things. I oh, know I'm hanging under here. You want me? Come down here, lady. I don't know. She has an angle to get me. I, I, I'm playing the angle game. Come on, teleport over. Ah, yeah. Chop, 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 chop. chop. I am playing the the um, cheating game here because I'm <laughs> not getting shot in the head. Oh, that's right, I'm low health. Oh no. Gotcha. What's this? Requires a small bead of blue wax. Probably from this candle here. Oh, what's this one do? Oh, there's a lot of red one. I forgot about that. Uh, law. The abbey ceased to be quiet. A quiet place. Cries of pain coming from every cell pierced the walls. The old. Oh, that's right. We read this before. With a small one. Small bead of wax. Tiny pebble of melted wax. Of dust, dusty cerulean. The cries from tortured zealots still reverberate inside. It slightly strengthens the wearer's fever. Alright. And. Yeah, old friar. Alright, this case, that's the. Same laws of blue, red ones. That's not too bad. That wasn't too bad because we sort of figured out a system to beat up the wax ladies. But yeah, we gotta ask the, uh, the item on the other side of this thing. I didn't that's the poison travel room. Fun to do. And prep. Thank you. That's not too bad because when I get low health, I can kill those hopping guys with like one punch. And that's it. Okay, let's just 
Give you a nope. See, I can get rid of them if I used the. if I had favor. Okay, so it's just outside each room each time. That's good. Out to here. Grab this. I have the piece of golden mask. Of a golden mask. Ooh. Ah, the piece. Okay, a piece of embo embossed gold, part of a mask. Part of a uh, mask broken years ago. The nuns of the Covenant of the Child Visage wear, swear never to let the world see their burned faces, and the conviction of its old wearer has permeated the metal. Grants some protection against flames. Oh, excellent. That's handy. Number two. The years passed and she started showing natural signs of aging. Just like her companions, except for the burn, which remained as fresh as the moment the boiling oil had spilled. The wound was still smolt smoking, scorching and reeking. This was understood to be a miracle, and she was canonized in life by the church. She became known as Our Lady of the Charred Visage. An order was founded in her name, where all the existing nuns were, as well as those who wanted to take up the habit, had to burn their faces in the same way as Aura had. She wears a golden mask under which she hides the gaze, that's the gauze that alleviates the eternal pain that burns still inflicts on her. Fire protection. Really need that health. Yeah, I broke a thing and there's like explosion now. Okay, uh, I suppose we should head down, back down now to. Or get blow torched. One or the other. Seems a point way to end this episode, we can kill every other way. So, when we come back, folks, we shall continue to look through this monastery of the, our li of the charred visage. Come on, not the charred visage. Visage. There's a thing in this room I want to get, and I don't know how to get it. At least I can. I know when I got bile thingy, let's go here and just like. Give that to that lady, she statue and she enhanced it, but to get there is an annoyance. I just realized this because I gotta go around the way. Darn. Oh well. I've got four health files now, so that's fine. <clears throat> Probably when we're done here, we more likely head to the cistern. To the great cistern, or go here, because it looks like the little path down I didn't take. That's all for next time, though. So until then, until then, I'll catch you all later. See ya.